So today we're going to show you one way of spoiling your dad for Father's Day. You don't always have to buy a present to make someone feel special. So today we're demonstrating a pedi. We're only going to do this one foot. But you can just repeat everything on the other side. As you can see, men usually have bigger feet than women. So if your ball is a little bit too small, it's okay. You're only going to soak the foot in water for a little while. Depending on how your father likes the temperature of the water, it can be anything from, from lukewarm water to a bit hotter. Okay, so you just soak the foot. Then you can use any scrub that you have. So I'm using a Kalahari scrub. Okay, rub your hands. Now you're just going to support the foot. Bring it a little bit out of the water. Make sure you get the heels with the scrap because they're usually a bit harder, especially now in winter time. And by exfoliating the feet, you're getting rid of all the dead skin cells. So your mother is probably going to ask you for a pity as well. Make sure to get in between the toes, unless your client for the day is ticklish, then you avoid those areas. Okay, then you're just going to place it back in the water. You're always more than welcome to do the pedicure higher up the leg. That is completely up to you. Okay, and when you're done with the soak and the foot scrub, you will remove the water from the bed or whichever area it is that you chose to do the pedi. Okay, once again, make sure you get in every nook and cranny unless it's a ticklish client. Okay. So, now that the soak is done and the feet is nice and soft, if you have something like this tool to push back the cuticles, you're more than welcome to use it. So very softly, you just push back the cuticle. Don't use pressure and if the cuticle doesn't want to be pushed back then just leave it we don't want to hurt our very special client for the day okay and then if your client wants you to cut the nail or use a nail file, you're more than welcome. Just remember to not go too round in the corners as it might cause ingrowns. Okay, so I'm not going to cut. So you can just cut the nail. Or if you like a cleaner look, you can always use a night nail file. And just file the toenails nice and neatly. Okay, so when all the hard work is done, then we're going to go into the massage. Okay. 
Okay, so if you have a very restless client as I do, it is okay. It is Father's Day, so we're just going to let them be. So after you scrubbed and you did the cuticles and you made the nails nice and short and neat, we go on to the pedic oh, the massage for the pedicure. Sorry. Okay, so if your dad has very long hair on his uh, legs, don't do too much swirly movements as it can actually be very irritating. So let's just focus on the foot. Areas that are very nice to work is here in the arch of the foot. So you just slide pressure and you just let your finger go down and you bring it back up and down. So you can do that a few times. Then also give special attention to the heels. So what you can do is you can hold the foot like this and just roll with these parts of your hands. Okay, so you can do that a few times. Just make circles here. Okay, then with the toes, you just make circular movements on the toe. Get the cuticles so that they stay nourished. Okay, and then you're going to go and you're going to turn one toe at a time, clockwise, three times, and anti-clockwise, three times, just to loosen up the lids a bit. And don't be shy to touch the toes, like grab it and twist. Otherwise, it can also be a very irritating movement. Then on the ball of the foot, you're going to take the foot like this. And you're going to go with your thumbs in this direction on the ball of the foot. Okay, you can always go up and down as well. And then just, uh, hopefully your client is more relaxed. And then you just do a few movements. And voila! One foot is done. So I really hoped this video helped you for an uh, idea for Father's Day. And um, yeah, we look forward to sharing more videos in the future.